Alright, so I just did the video about the cocky YouTubers or whatever, and I want to address this as well. Jealousy. Now, okay, you guys know, I'm not a jealous person. I want to see everybody succeed and everybody do their thing and, you know, that whole thing. I do. I really, I like, I like to see my peoples, you know, do their thing. Because that's, I mean, that's good to see somebody going to come up and doing their thing. I don't hate on nobody. And I'm not jealous of no one's success. I, I want people to be successful. That's the point of life, to succeed and get far, you know. But jealousy is a disease and some bitches are looking real sick. And it makes no sense for you to be jealous of someone because they're, they're furthering their self. Like, you... Okay, that's, for example, if I was the type of person who didn't do shit, and then I had a friend who did a whole bunch of stuff, and I was jealous at them because they're, they're doing something, and they don't want to just sit back and be a bump on the log like me, then, you know what I'm saying? Like, that would be kind of stupid if you ask me, but, I mean, it, it, to me, what it really stems from is insecurities. So, you're insecure about their success because you don't want to do what's good for you because... Somehow, someone you let in one of your insecurities stop you when they are just free as the wind and free as the bird and they don't care. They just want to be successful in life. But, you know, to be jealous of someone because someone is, you know, the problem is, this is the problem right here. When people get jealous of other people, it's because they get too comfortable. They get too comfortable doing what they do, whatever it is. They could be uh, a receptionist. They could be anything. They get comfortable doing what they do, and then somebody else comes up who's doing them, and they all of a sudden it's a problem. They got an issue. It's a problem. You know, and I see it a lot in, um, because my cousin, she's younger, and a lot of teenage girls where... One is jealous of the other one because her hair is longer, or she's lighter, or she got cuter clothes, or she, whatever the situation may be. It's like, why be jealous? I'm the type of person, I don't have a jealous bone in my body. I want to see everybody succeed. That's why, you know, I, when people tell me, you know, today I got offered a scholarship for so, so well, congratulations. Like, I want to see you do well. I, I really, oh, I'm that type of person. I want people to be well, do good. You know, whatever the situation may be, but then you got the people who just want them to just be just solely nothing. You know, just solely just, just, mm-mm, you, mm, why, why they pick you? You know, it's just always a negative undertone. It's always some jealousy shit going on. I can't stand that. And that's why I don't kick it with a lot of people. Because <laughs> being jealous is not a cute thing, especially in 2010. Like, Really? You're jealous of someone in 2010? Well, my, my question to anybody who's jealous is this. Why be jealous when you can do it too? Why be jealous when you can get off your shit and do your shit too? There's no reason to be hating on what the next bitch is doing because you can do it too. They ain't no better than you. So what's the problem? But people let that hinder them. People really start to go after the person and go after them for stupid, millennials reasons. You stupid, bitch. Why you, why, 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 you tell me, why, because that's real cute for you, for you to sit back and really think that what you're doing is, is something, you know, so, what I don't get is this, a lot of people really, really, you know what I'm saying, they dislike me for, for various reasons, but what I've come to understand and know about a lot of stuff is that people are jealous of me for the simple fact that I do me, and I do me fully. I don't half-ass me. I do me fully. Because, hey, honey, I got one life, and I'm going to live it to the fullest. But some people let what other people say hinder what they really want to do. So what ends up happening is you sit back, and you worry about somebody else, and you don't worry about you, but then you're jealous when you see another motherfucker just doing it, killing it, and not caring. They don't care. Neither should you. But you do, for the wrong reasons. And that's where the problems come in, and I think that's why a lot of people hate and are jealous or get mad at other people is because they see something in that person that they really, really, really want. You know, like, you know, jealousy and insecurity go hand in hand. But I, a lot of girls will hit me up and say, oh, I'm jealous of your hair, or I envy you because you do your thing. Or don't do, I say don't do that. Do not envy, do not hate, do not be jealous. These are all negative terms. You don't want to do that. You want to be you. Just be you. That's all, I, that's all I encourage anybody else to do is just be them. You know, because jealousy is a disease. Like, seriously, it can take out a I know a lot of people who lost their friends because of jealousy. I lost a friend because of jealousy. You know, and it's because 
you don't want to see me further myself or you don't want to see me successful like why why would you want that that, that's the point of us even trying to, to, to do things that we do in life is because we want to succeed and go far. But, you know, there, there are things that you may see in life that other people do. You be like, dang, I wish I could do that or I wish I was doing that. But you know what? Everything comes within time. Because it's right for someone else doesn't mean that it's right for you. That's what people don't get. Oh, why she do it and I can't do it? No, you, it's not good for you right now, honey. It's not meant for you right now. So you sit back and you still continue your drive and your, your grind and the things that you're doing and you just let it happen. You sit back and you let it happen. I, 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 I've always been a firm believer into that. You sit back and you, whatever your destiny is, as long as you're doing what you're supposed to do, it's going to come. And you, you be right and you be respectful to all the people who have helped you and all the people who have, you know, lifted you up. You take those people with you and, you know, you be good. But don't be jealous and then you get up here and then, you know, you don't know nobody no more. And you don't want to see nobody get, you know, hit that stride like you hitting it. Because then that's the problem. And it makes you look very, very fake. It makes you, you know how I am. I don't like fake ass people. I don't. And as soon as I sense some type of fakery going on, bitch, I gotta go. I gotta go. I throw my hands up, I wash my hands, and I'm done with it. Because I can't do that. I can't, if you, like, for instance, and people do it on the sly. For instance, we was at um, Gay Pride in Long Beach, right? So we're, we're sitting, we're sitting like this. It's Ebony broken sir will it's me and i'm talking to two females um who had noticed me from youtube so we're having a conversation and all of a sudden it's a group of gay dudes of course it's gay pride gay dudes come out you know in the cluster they're standing about right here mind you all of this in the front is to where we're standing is like the the stage and all of they playing music everybody's having a good time no problem but then i feel this energy coming you know well, I'm having a conversation a nice conversation and to the two young ladies that did stop and speak to me I love you guys you guys were very very sweet I forgot what their names were but they were very very sweet and we had a long conversation and um you know I'm looking and I'm just seeing the faces I'm seeing a whole lot of this mm. 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 you know what I'm saying I'm like I ain't, I ain't said nothing to nobody so one decides to approach me I know you just like literally just like I know you. And I'm like, okay. You, he said something slick. I forgot what it was. But he had this cute little jean top situation on my homegirl. Like, your outfit is cute. I'm like, yeah, that's cute. And I guess it kind of threw him off the fact that I paid him a compliment because I wasn't a jealous, hateful bitch. And he thought I was going to be like, eh, to him. But I'm not like that. You know, I gave him a compliment. So he kind of walked off and did the whole type of situation because he didn't know that I was going to be cool. He didn't know I was going to be cordial. He thought I was going to be a bitch. Like, he approached me to be a bitch. You know what I'm saying? Trying to be funny. But, you know, it's, it's, it's shit like that, you know, that makes people not want to be around you. It's shit like that that makes people not want to deal with you. Because it's like, why are you like this? It's like everything I do in life, you're going to be mad about. When I get, when I do something good, I get accolades and, and how you doing? Great, great, great. You did a great job from everybody on Twitter. Broken, my mom, my granny, Everybody, you know, you did a good job. I'm going to go give you a problem. Ain't nobody going to say, hmm, that's cute. Bitch, really? So, I don't do that. I don't, I don't deal with none of that at all because of the simple fact that people really, really, you know, get on this jealousy shit. And then once it starts, it's hard to stop it because they get so accustomed to doing it and they don't know that they're doing it. And then, you know, what are you supposed to do? Sit back and say, oh, it's cool that you're being jealous towards me because I know what type of person you are fuck that no I'm not dealing with it you is a bitch you a bitch and you if you're gonna wear your title wear it proudly I respect you more if you come to me and say I'm a bitch and I don't like you I respect you for that because you were at least honest about it you got people who will sit back and lie to you oh no I don't have nothing against you I don't have no problems with you you cool and turn right back around and be the most hateful jealous bitch ever you know so to my people if you are having little jealous bones in your body, don't do that. Because whoever you're jealous of, if they can do it, you can do it. Just put your mind to it. Do what the fuck you gotta do to get where you gotta go. Stop worrying about what everybody else is doing, bitch, because their shit is not your shit. Worry about your shit. What's for somebody else is not always for you. And that's what people have to understand. Success come in all different colors, shapes, sizes. 
prayers, everything. So no was made for you. We are all different. We are all tailored for something different in life. So just because another bitch did something, that don't mean that that's you. And there's no need to hate on him or her for doing what they're doing. You feel? All right. So thank you guys for coming to. No, I'm just playing. But um, thank you guys. I love you guys um a lot. And um. That's all I got to say right now. We are 13,000 strong. And um, I thank everybody for telling their friends and mamas and cousins and aunties and grannies to watch us. And um, I appreciate you guys so much. I will talk to you guys later. Peace. And don't be jealous. Be happy.